Hi, this is Charlene from Schultz, and I'm going to take you through a brief uh, tutorial on how to use Google Classroom. Let me share my screen with you and take you into the classroom. So as you may know at this point, in order to use Google Classroom, you must have a Gmail account. With the Gmail account, you have some options. You will see that there are a number of apps and one of those is the Google Classroom. When you click on that, uh, you will get uh, through the links that I send you access to the classrooms for this class. So when I click up here on the main menu, I have the list of classes. And let's say, let's, we start with um, videos, links, and other materials. When you come click on that, you come into this and you should be able to play the videos that are linked here. So let me just go ahead and do this as an example. So I've created a link here for the last class from the last session. I'm gonna go ahead and copy, control C, that passcode. And when I click on this, it will take me to Zoom, ask me for that passcode and it'll allow me to access the recording. And you should be able to I skipped forward through the initial meet and greet that we do, but then this should take you into that um, video recording. As you can see, there we are, and I can go ahead and play this. Sure, but, a little bit of yellow, a little bit of yellow panel. Uh, you can do that on your own. Our videos, and they are recorded in Zoom, and they get posted here along with the passcode under this classroom, right? One of the things that we ask you to do is to post student work. Well, how do you go about doing that? So you can come into here and it says announce something to your class, but I'm going to add something. So I want to add a picture. So it's gonna ask me where, what kind of picture. I'm going to go to file. And then it's gonna ask me if I wanna drag something in here. So in this case, let me go ahead and drag this that I had on my desktop. And now that I've done that, I pull it up into here and hit post. And it's as simple as that. Well, once it's here, you can actually go back in, click on the three buttons, you can edit, you can delete, you can do some other things with it. So that's a very short tutorial on how to use Google Classroom.